Hi everyone, uh, this is a video where I'm going to summarise Sperry's 1968 study into hemispheric lateralisation uh, in hopefully about 60 seconds. I've got my phone timer here, let's see how we go. Start the clock. In 1968, Sperry carried out an observation of 11 patients who had undergone surgery to disconnect the corpus callosum, that's the bundle of nerves that join up the two hemispheres of the brain. He gave them a series of verbal, visual and tactile tasks with words and objects being presented to one visual field for a tenth of a second at a time. When an object was shown to the left visual field, participants could draw it with their left hand and identify it by touch, but they couldn't name it. When it was shown to the right visual field, they could verbally name it as well. That's a key. That's because only the left hemisphere of the brain has got language abilities. These results were also shown in tactile tests. Participants could only name objects when they grabbed them with their right hand. That's a pen. Uh, Sperry found that emotions are controlled by the right hemisphere of the brain as well by embarrassing participants using a task that used the left visual field. It was a naughty picture. The conclusions of the study are that brain functions like language are lateralized with only the left hemisphere controlling language and each hemisphere controlling and responding to the opposite side of the body. It's highly controlled and standardized, but the sample is unrepresentative and it lacks ecological validity. That is one minute and one second it says 366 but i know i was quicker if you, you uh, find your brain is as broken as sparrow's participants were after that maybe try watching this video on like 0.75 speed give it a go see you next time